When a nearly three hour long subtitled film about lesbians wins the Palm d'Or at Cannes, you might think you know what you're going to get, a long, worthy, issue-led movie. You would be so wrong about Blue is the Warmest Colour because it's a profoundly insightful look at relationships between young people and what it feels like to be intensely in love. Adele is a 17-year-old schoolgirl who's having relationships with boys that aren't really going anywhere. She meets this incredibly charismatic art student, a little bit older with blue hair, called Emma, and they fall head over heels in love. There's immediately a long, intense sex scene that's already got people talking, but it's vital in knowing that these people are consumed by their feelings for each other. They can't get enough of each other. Of course, there's more for the relationship to play out. It's about what it's like to be inside the world of a relationship and how that relates to your world outside that as well, with their families, with their friends. But it's all about these two central performances. You see every emotion passing over their faces and in their eyes, such honest, unflinching performances. They are stunning and the film is exceptional.